I want to talk to you today about what to do if you know or have kids who are horror shows. And there are kids who are horror shows. Really, really difficult kids. That can happen in toddlerhood where you get that toddler who just won't take no for an answer and ask for crazy things in crazy places. Or I had a, a latency age kid who, who was just really violent. He just hit all the other kids. And then I had a, another teen, she was goth and she'd cut the bottom of her feet and walk around the house and leave blood all over. How do you deal with these kids that are just determined to be horror show terror kids? The answer to that question is you have to let them know that you still love them. And you do that just by carrying on as usual. Uh, you say, well, what would you like for dinner? And uh, do we need to buy you a new pair of shoes? And, you know, the problem is we get very stressed out with kids like that, and that prevents them from talking. They reach a point where, well, they can't please the parent. It's a point of no return, and then they become shameless. They just don't care anymore. So to keep them talking and keep them open, you have to just find any way you can to let them know that they're still loved so that they can recover from their uh, genetic dispositions. Bye.